Hey guys. Um, sorry, I was hungry. I wanted uh, some baby carrots here, so I thought I would just uh, go ahead and grab a couple of them. Um, let's go ahead and get started on today's Wordle. What, what's today? Oh, this is uh, um, Monday. Monday. Monday, September 4th. Let's go ahead and do the Wordle for today. These carrots are pretty good. Okay, so this is the Wordle for Monday. So my randomly selected starting guess for Monday is the word swill. Let's put in swill and see if I can get any good information from this. Hopefully I can solve this one pretty quickly today. And there's just a yellow eye. All right. So I think that a good guess here might be the word right. Is the word right? It's not right. There's a G in here though. Okay, fantastic. Um, So I'm thinking about something like ridge but uh we've already uh used the r so it could be i guess midge is a word isn't that that little insect thing or am i thinking of uh was it a different is there a different word for that let's try midge it's not midge that's not where the g goes but there is a d there is giddy a word um, otherwise, ID, the G goes at the end. If, if the G goes at the end, ID, hmm, GID, something Y, GID, is giddy a word? Let me put in giddy. Is it giddy today? It's just giddy. All right. Fantastic. Okay, I got the wordle in four today. That was also a pretty quick solve. Let me just look up the word midge because I want to be sure, I want to make sure I know what midge is i thought it was like that little insect thing it is it's a small fly okay fantastic i remember somebody telling me that before at, in a wordle solve like a year ago and i remembered that today and it helped out a little bit so it was not right it was giddy all right fantastic that was a solve for monday september 4th let's go ahead and move on to solving tuesday solve here we go, Tuesday, September 5th. Let's go ahead and get started on today's Wordle. Today, my randomly selected starting guess is the word nurse. This seems like a really good word to use, has a lot of great letters in it, two vowels. Let's go ahead and put this in and see how I do for this one. There's an R right in that third position. Okay, so I don't have a vowel yet. Uh, I could do something like orch. I really like that, actually. That could be a really... Could get some really good information. Let's put in torch today. It is not torch. It does end in RCH. Okay, fantastic. Um, so, okay. So we've used up the O, the U, and the E. So we have an A or an I. Oh, it could be birch like this. That's a word. Um, I'm trying to think of with, with an A. March. I think we've already had that. Let's put in birch. It is birch today. That was a super fast solve. That is one of the reasons why I am combining multiple solves into a single video is because some of these are really quick like that. All right, guys, let's talk. So I'm making some changes to this channel. So I want to try my best right now to explain to you guys what is happening. And it's going to get a little confusing because even I don't really know what I'm doing here. Okay. But long story short, here's the most important thing for you to know is that moving forward on this channel, at the very least for the next several weeks to a couple of months, I don't want to upload three videos a day. That's currently what I've been doing the past couple of months is I've been uploading a Wordle video, a connections video, and a mini crossword video to this channel. And uh, three videos a day is not something that I want to do anymore. So I want to only upload one video per day. Now, this is where it gets confusing because I still want to play these games. The only question is, how do I, how do I uh, compact these all into only seven videos a week, right? So what's going to have to end up happening is something like what you just saw in this video where... I took two different Wordle solves and I put them in a single video. Um, that is something that I'm going to be doing now on this channel is having multiple solves in a single video. So that's something that I want you guys to sort of just remember when you click on a video, when you watch one of my videos, 
is that I'll do a solve and then I'll do another solve. And the most confusing part of all of this is probably going to be how I structure the weekly schedule, which solves get put into what videos and that I really don't even know yet how it's going to work. It might look something like this. It might look like Monday, I'll do a Wordle video and it'll have two solves in it. Tuesday, I'll have a connections video and that will have two solves in it. Wednesday, I'll go back to Wordle and have two solves in it, right? For the day that you've missed and whatnot. That could be potentially the structure of the weekly upload schedule. Now, as far as am I going to include the solve for that day that it's uploaded or am I going to wait until the next day before I include that solve? I'm not sure. It's it's actually kind of something that I don't know what I'm going to do. The alternative, which I haven't even thought about really until just now, is maybe I include the Wordle and the connections uh, in the same video. So for a single day, um, that's also an alternative. Now, the mini crossword is sort of getting left out here because I feel like it's well, first of all, it's definitely getting the least amount of views on this channel. I still really like playing the mini crossword and I will most likely um, upload a mini crossword video on Saturdays because they're the bigger ones. Um, it's sort of getting left behind in all of this and it might end up just being completely um, not done on this channel or maybe it's something that I only play when I do a live stream, which I could start doing more of those. Um, so... You might be wondering what is the point in doing all of this. Um, by the way, um, another reason why I might stop uploading the mini crossword is because I cannot pre-record the mini crossword a day or several days ahead of time. Those are only, you can't change the date on your computer. You can't go to the, the mini crossword and play it for the next day it only has the one available so i've learned that and i and that's a problem because one of the things that i want to start doing now is pre-recording a lot of these videos several days ahead of time just so i have them and they can just be up um now as far as why only one video per day this is also something that is you know gonna take a little bit of an explanation because for you guys, it doesn't make any sense why I would do this. But for me, I get to see some analytics on my channel and I'm looking at how many views my videos are getting. And a really unfortunate thing started happening when I started uploading three videos to this channel. And it's sort of counterintuitive and it's sort of unexpected was that once I started uploading three videos a day, instead of only the Wordle video, um, all of a sudden, from that precise moment, I started uploading three videos a day. All of a sudden, each of my individual Wordle videos that I uploaded started getting less and less views. So now that we're two months into this, the Wordle videos are getting about 25% less views. I was averaging about 500 views per video. Now the Wordle videos are only at like 350. And I don't know exactly what is causing the views to go down. But all I, I can tell you guys is that it happened once I started uploading three videos a day. So in order to appease the algorithm or in order to sort of try to start growing this channel, try to start getting more views, more new people on the channel, um, I'm, I want to start messing around a little bit with the uploads here. So I'm not only just changing the schedule, um, I'm also changing the thumbnails of these videos. Uh, so, uh, one thing that I want you guys to keep in mind as you watch me the next couple of weeks or so is that these Wordle videos were not, you will not see the same thumbnails as what you have been, uh, and they will be different probably every day. Um, and really it's just about experimentation. Uh, that's really what I'm doing right now is I'm doing a little bit of experimentation with video style, video schedule, uh, I'm doing experimentation with thumbnails. So uh, it might be something that you don't understand. It might be something that you don't agree with or you don't like. However, 
um, I'm sort of just taking taking my own channel into my own hands to try to to see what works and what doesn't work. And in a couple of months, if this is a total failure, if it if it um you know if it actually decreases my views instead of increasing them, then of course I can go back to doing th things the way things have been. Um, as far as like getting used to this, I know that it's not normal. Um, it's not something that I've done at all ever in the past. And I'm certainly stepping outside of the norm in terms of, you know, you don't see any other uh, YouTube channel or uh, you don't see any other Wordlers um, do this scheduling thing or this style. Um, so it's going to be different. Um, but for me, um, I'm trying to learn and I'm trying to find out uh, how to get individual videos of these word games. How can I get these videos recommended more to new people? Kind of just uh, do what the algorithm wants, and it's gonna it's gonna be a learning experience. Um, I'm hoping to edit my videos a little bit more. I am, um, you know, new thumbnails and stuff, new schedule. Uh, also, <clears throat> another additional thing that I forgot to totally mention here was that if you are a member of the channel. I would like to try to make this transition, this change as easy as possible for you guys. Um, one of the things that I can do is I, if I wanted to, I could take the individual solves that I do for these daily games and upload them um, as separate videos that are member exclusive. So if you're a member of the channel, you can actually watch me solve each of these games um, individually each day and I can upload them on the day that they're solved um, I can do that just as a way to sort of um, you know give members extra perks so if you aren't a member right now you know hit that join button and become a member I just want the videos that are publicly uploaded the videos that I have on my channel that um, that get affected by the algorithm I want to try to incorporate new practices again with the video uh, style and with the thumbnails and whatnot so um yeah i would strongly uh, appreciate it and, cons and and uh recommend that you guys consider um becoming a member of the channel just because that helps me out a lot you know again another part of this that you know i probably don't even need to say is that um as much as i enjoy making videos i enjoy playing these games you know the incentive as far as channel growth views and revenue that incentive um is a big deal um i think everybody who has a youtube channel is hoping that their channel will grow that one of their videos will take off and get a lot of views because the more your channel grows the more revenue revenue you have and it would be awesome if my channel got big enough to where the income from the revenue from the ads and whatnot if the income was um significant enough for me to you know um supplement my, supplement my income or whatever it, it, just, it would just be great but that of course only has to that will only come if the videos that if the videos that you upload if they're good enough and if they're if people want to watch them right so unfortunately not a lot of people really want to watch wordle and whatnot so it's a kind of a smaller audience but you know um we'll see what happens again I can always go back and, and stop doing this. It might be a little confusing for you guys, but this is just the decision that I'm making right now, and I thought it'd be important to try to explain it to you guys, even if you, um, even if it's difficult to understand. And and again, I don't exactly know what's going to be happening moving forward, but hopefully, I learn as we go. So, anyway, appreciate you guys listening. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Hope you're all feeling good, and I will see you in the next video. Take care.